What is up guys? Joe Holland here. This is a really exciting one for me. We're doing something completely different here in Maine. We're doing a 39 hours ice fishing tournament. There's like six or eight teams involved. A guy's running this in Maine off the same format that the big boys did out in Canada and central US. It is a species tournament. This one's a little bit different. There's three points for the longest of each species, two for the second longest, one point for the third longest. The team with the most points wins. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna try to get on the board with as many species as we can, and some good ones too, and see if we can accumulate the most amount of points that. We only have 39 hours to do it. Tournament started five minutes ago. We're running a little late. The boys were a little late this morning showing up. Three man teams. I have Jack and Brandon from my previous videos. You ready to roll? Oh, yeah. They're ready to roll. Let's go, guys. You, I'm good. Do you want this tucked around you? Yeah. <laughs> <How's that? laughs> Look at this. Look at Jack. If it gets cold, just put that over your head. You can fire it to warm up. chance for three four species right here jack in this hole i don't know how pinpointed i put you but it's pretty close and actually you got a chance for five species i jigged a 13 pound pike right here with that rod well close to it all right you all set buddy yep all good okay good luck holler if you get something nice What's that, buddy? You ever had skunk here? Nope. But I would never ask that. <laughs> I'd never ask that. <laughs> now that we talked about it, we'll probably get skunked. Oh no. It's really bad. Dylan, I see why you put him in headlocks. Is my beard starting to freeze? Yeah. Yeah. He's, he's frozen. It's pretty bad, isn't it? <laughs> Not as deep over here, fellas. We're in like 15 to 15. How big a shaman do you want? Average, medium size. Like, this is black line. I don't like black line, but we're going to fish it. All right. So we got that, that, and we're going to hold them off the bottom, foot and a half maybe. On this one, make them work a little bit. Yep, perfect. Thank you. Score update. <laughs> All right, Luke. 13, almost 13 and a half inch bass. Myself, Collins, and Jacob here. Oh, God, you got 20 already. It made a half turn? Yeah. So some of these, some of these pigs for pike will just sit right there. No, I don't see my mark. They may have taken yeah, some. Yeah, definitely took some line. Right, I'm gonna let you catch this one, all right, bud? Not yet, though. Let's, this was the smelt, I think. I think it is the smelt. should have eaten it. So it's got a good hook, and it's got minimum 40-pound fluoro or steel. So don't be afraid to set that hook right. and jack him, all right, if he's if you feel him. I don't think he's... It might be, Yeah, he's on there. If you, When you feel him, nail him. And I'll keep this... Lay the line out to the side, because he might take all this back, okay? okay? If you feel him, jack him. If not, just bring it up. I don't feel nothing. So he took four foot. A little hit and run action. Yeah. I think this was the smelt. I'll find out in a minute. Or was it the shiner? Mm. That's that smelt. Is he chewed? Nope, he's swimming good though. I don't believe he tripped. It. Score up. Alright, just landed a cock and bass. Let's see. 17, just over 17 and a quarter. Beautiful, beautiful. We got, our code. Pass. We got our code. Oh, yeah. Nice one. Heck yeah. There you go. 
too. Yeah, that was a long time. <laughs> Ooh. Nice. That's a good eater size right there. Oh, here he comes. Yeah, you're about to get one. Yeah. He's on you. He's on. Yeah. <laughs> Why well, am I feeling? Because he, he ate upwards. So some of these could be crappy? Yep. Those kind of look like it. Ooh, ooh. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Nice. First crappy on the board. You can probably eat that yeah, size. Oh, yeah. That's probably a yellow. Hammered it. Oh, he's giving you a good bend. This might be a decent fish. Oh, uh, yellow. He sucked that thing in, though. Yeah, they hit. Yellow's hit way harder than crappy. Pretty long yellow, huh? He's probably close to 12 inches. That's our biggest yellow yet. Yeah, he's right there. I got him. Little guy. He might not be too bad. Yeah, look at that one. Another long one. These are not bad yellows. That's pretty good size yellow right there, dude. Look at that. Look at the school, huh? Those might be some... Oh, look, he's coming in hot for you. Oh, he's hammering it. Oh, that's, that's a big one. That, is it? Yeah. Is it crappy? Ooh, I don't know. Big yellow, big crappy. Big. Oh, yes, nice. That's about like the other ones. We got a wicked school of yellows here. I'm about to catch one. This is so good about the head. Uh, I got my drag super loose because I have my reels frozen. Everything's frozen. It's 13 below zero. Whoa, crappy. That's another, that's another good eater. Yep, that's a good eater size. He's 10 inch. Yeah, they're mixed in those crappy. I'll take, I'll take, I don't know. I you want me to keep him for you, right? I could take so many of those things. I haven't had a crappy batch all year. Score update. Alright, we're out here. Decent yellow perch. Eleven inches. Eleven inches. Here's the code. Alright. That felt pretty good. Feels like a decent yellow. That's a pretty decent sized stool. Mm -hmm. This is a yellow, it's a decent one. Oh, dude. Look at that yellow. That's gonna get us on the board. Oh, I got a big one too. Nice. Oh, yeah. That's gonna get us on the board. That's over 12 inches, easy. Yeah, that's a good one. That's a beautiful yellow, look at that thing. Ooh. You got a good one? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> big school yeah. yellows. Which one's bigger? Probably this one, right? Yeah, that, that's a staver. These are staven yellows. These are like Staven Tiger Trout. Yeah. Main Tiger Trout. Look at the size of that one. They call those jumbos. Got him. Another decent, I think. Look at the other ones followed up. Yep, decent. Look at that one, huh? Another decent. These are perfect eater size yellows. Oh, you got a school on you. <laughs> yeah, I thought you were going to get him. We got a nice school going, buddy. Oh, yeah. Ooh, How's it going? This one's pretty big. Good one? Is it crappy or yellow? I hope it's a crappy, but I think it's a yellow. That'd be awesome. It's freaking Either nice. way, though. Yeah. Yeah, another solid yellow 10 inch. Look at that school. Well, that thing's sucking in. So that one I caught came in right at 12 inches. Right at the 12 inch mark with the nose closed. Mouth closed, I mean. And all right, it's almost pike time. We got a pretty good little stack going on. Oh, look at this. They're coming way up for me. Got him. That fool's all right. Unless he's just way off to the side. Oh, we can catch 200 of these. That's about a, that's a good eater right there. Look at that, he choked that. He came flying up. They're, they're starting to compete. Kill him loves this stuff. Oh, does he? Go get him. Look at that one. Oh, no, I hear them in there. They're jiggling it in. Eat it. It looked like he ate it. Yeah, there you go. Crappy or perch? I don't know. Pretty heavy. Is it? 
You need a hand or you got them? It feels like crappy, but... Oh, I hope that's a crappy. No. Ah, little yellow. It's weird how they're marked. Some marked a lot bigger. No, this is a different type of jigging than I'm definitely used to. Well, uh, you'll get better. Oh, oh, look at that. I was wondering why we didn't have anything on the screen. Oh, yeah. Did he, did he run? It's moving. Did it move? Yep. Oh, yeah, there we go. Slow roll. All right, you, we probably ought to reel these in. I doubt it. You know what? Let's not wait on this guy. It hasn't worked yet, so let's let's see if he's there. If it's a big yellow, we'll weigh him. Anything? Took the bait. So probably a big yellow or a pickerel. Yeah. School oh, crappy. Update. Thirteen and three quarter inches. There's the code. Nice one, bud. Right now we're starting on. We're setting our traps for pike, and we're jigging for the panfish. We're jigging for yellow perch. We're jigging for crappy, and we're jigging for white perch. And we might even jig for some rock bass today. They're down there. We are having a, a heck of a day already on the jig train. We got a twelve inch yellow, which might not do it, but it's it's honorable. We got. Couple decent crappies. Like a 10, 10 oh, and a half inch crappie. A, should be a crappie in the. Oh, I think we lost the crappie off the back. Oh, it's right there. Oh, no, yeah, we had another crappie somewhere. Didn't we? So, for us, our game plan is to to shotgun the numbers. We're going to play the numbers game. We're not looking for just a 40 inch pike, although we'll take it. Brandon's got hooked up over here. We're Good one? Ooh, he said. We're looking to try to get as many points as we can get. So if it's one point, two point, three point, that's a nice yellow there. We'll take whatever points we can get. So we figure it'll, we'll give our chance ourselves the best chance to win by having the most fish species caught. And somewhere on that board by length will be decent one way or the other. To start, like I said, we're on pike and we're on the panfish. Panfish aren't huge here, but the yellows can get pretty big. So we're gonna focus on the yellows right now. We're gonna try to get a pike and then we might even get out of here and go for some bigger fish somewhere else. Nice uh, 11 and a half inch ice cube crappy. It's not taking long to freeze up today, is it? Nope. Did you catch that one jigging? Yeah. Nice, good job, buddy. Thanks. How, do you guys have a lot on the screen over there or no? We're getting marks, but they're being funny. Yeah. They're, they're definitely crappy then. Yeah. Because the yellows are taking no time to hit. Yeah. Yeah, he's all over you still. I think these are small crappy. Oh man, he just ate. Yeah, you had him. Took my shiner. Yep. I can get this out. I'll catch him for you. Get that shiner back, yeah. I'm gonna text to see if it's probably nothing. Got him. He feels decent. Grab this fish. That's a good one. Oh, dude. That's a good crappy, dude. Giant. Oh, Isn't that giant? That's pretty good. Bigger than 13. What, what was our biggest so far? Oh, yeah, we're, we're 13. I think he's 13. I don't think he's got the quarter. But there's more of that size, so. Yeah. We, we don't take the tiebreaker there. Uh, if we tie him, he's, he's submitted first. Eleven and a half inch white perch. Call oh, is Lady we'll Jacob. Here, boys. Go. We got our first pike. We worked hard for this one. Took us long enough. Get it at 20, 21? Just over 21. Just over 21 inches. Nice. 21 inches. All right, yeah. Here's the code. All right.
score update. Team Barrowville, salmon number one. We got a flag. camera off. That's a pike. <laughs> all right, get him tough. So, Jeff, you might want to help him land this. Or here, you take this. I don't think it's huge. That's all right. We'll take it. We don't care about huge. Now, if he gets to the hole, if let he can't him. get his head go, let him go. It's yeah. a pike. Yep, just let him go right back through. Jack's got your line. There you go. He's not very big, but hey, okay. we'll take him. What do you think? Maybe wait another hour, see if we get another one? Yeah. Well, we'll let's get this one first. <laughs> That's true. It, it could be. Fast. <laughs> you got Floro here, so don't horse him. Get his head coming. There you go. You got him, just pull right straight back. Keep pulling, keep pulling. Don't give up. There you go. Cool. Take that. That's a pike. Let's get him on the measuring board so we see what we're at. Jack, there's a... Uh, like catch bags there, we can, we can pop this hook out. Good bike, buddy. You've got like four or five pounder. Came back to where it. Yeah, a lot of times they'll bite. He definitely wasn't there when I was pulling it in. He, he might have been coming back towards you. Yeah, they'll run out and they'll spin right around. My buddy caught a 40 out of some baddest and he thought he lost it. All right, what's the, what's the lead for Pike? Nothing. Or 21. All right, we got 28 and a half. So he's not huge. Get a picture. Yeah, it's scale, right? We don't have to weigh him. Oh. It's, it's just total measurement. With your hand in there. Yeah, I got it. And uh, you're blocking your shadow. Yeah. Oh, there you go, bud. Just good size. There you go. You come around if you want. All right, and then I need a video to show the world together. 28, 28 and a quarter. 28, 28 and a half. Quarter. 28 and a half. Uh, right yeah, let's get a picture. Uh, he's over five. Oh, that's a pretty one. All right, see you later, little gator. Now we got to make a decision, fellas. 28 and a half. I think they're just going to start to bite. Maybe we wait for one more. Try to get in the third. hour. Yeah, try to get in that 34 range. Six hours in, we got 33 hours left. We got three species on the board. We cannot find the, ro the rock bass. No. Which it happens, you know, they're they're not something I could pattern yet. I went to the three spots that I've caught them, they're not there, and then we look at some other rocks and they're not there. So they move around a lot. We probably won't be able to get a rock bass unless we just catch one jigging. But we have so we have three fish on the board. We have a crappie that's second, what was that, twelve and, and a half. half? Second place, right? Second place crappie. Right? It's all it's already only second place. Yeah, so yeah. we got a thirteen and uh, a half. We have a, a yellow that's twelve. That's first place. That's in first. And we have a first pike that's first for three points. Yep. All right. Now, I'm not confident on any of those. The that's only one hard. I think will, will hold for points is the yellow. A 12-inch yellow will hold for at least a point or two. So let's – I'm feeling this. Let's see what you guys think. I'm feeling like we wait this out another hour because it's about when the pike really turn jack on. Jack a big large mouth. Uh, no, we're not going to jack a large mouth here. But to try to get a pike in the 30 plus range, oh, just yeah. so, just so nobody goes over to Sabatis and pops a hammer handle on us, that's like 28, 29, and steals the points. Yeah, and it's just one point that they steal though. Yeah, that's true. That is true. So I think it's worth another hour. Then we got to start putting our heads together what we want to do with the rest of the day. We definitely cuss the night. Score update. Collins and Jacobs in here. Have you fished it before? Yeah. Uh, if we set traps in the weeds, we'll have a chance at getting a 14, 15, 16 inch fall fish. We have pickerel up to 26 inches that we've caught out of there. There's good perch and 
you're not gonna get any giant bass, but 17, 18 inches, small yeah, so and that's large. That's what we gotta think of. We got an afternoon bite, so we gotta think probably junk fish. And there's giant crappie there's no and such Hogan. Thing as junk fish. There's like 16, 17 inch crappie and Hogan. Do we want to? Do you know it? Yeah. You know it? Yeah. Know it? Know it? Yeah. I've I've been fishing it for like five or six years. How far is it from Sebago? Because we're ended up on Sebago tonight, minutes. right? Well, if it's from Oxford, it's gonna be a little bit more. Yeah, you got to go around Thompson, I guess. I it's only 20, 30 minutes from here? From Sebago. Probably probably the same thing yeah, for here. We could go, I know right where the deep hole is, where the big crappie should be. The fallfish and pickerel will get good size of both littering the milfoil. And I know right where the milfoil line is. It's like a channel that's like 10 feet that comes up to six. If we hit the channel and work into the edge of the milfoil, we got pickerel and fallfish. And then if you set traps like 15 to 25 or like 12 to 22, you'll get small... Smallmouth, maybe if they're active, they can be funky, but largemouth all day. All right, guys, we are making the move. I hate to leave with such a small pike, but it might be enough. Whoa, look at the icicles on my beard. Wow. Yeah, you're so mean. Yep. So we're leaving there with eight points, three species, two first place so far and one second place. And we're heading to a place where we might be able to take that crappy point back. We're going to a spot that should have how many? Seven different species, maybe eight different species. There's, It'll be in play this there, afternoon. Yeah, seven catchable. It's one o'clock, meaning we are seven hours into this. There's 32 hours left for us to get it done. Let's get it done. All right, so what are our objectives for this pond that we're going to now? So our main goal is uh, to get some new species on the board. Um, fall fish, which no one submitted one. I know there's some big ones in here. I've caught them 15 plus inches. Uh, there's some big pickerel. We've got them over two feet long here. So if we can get one of those, we'll edge out that 13 and a half incher. Uh, we could upgrade and steal the crappy point, take first place. And bass, uh, we got largemouth. There's a chance for smallmouth too. It's kind of weird. It's got to be the right day for the smallmouth. But uh, even if we just catch a largemouth that's at least eight inches, it's two points for us. And that should be a pretty easy fish to catch. Oh, so, yeah. That's in there's white and yellow perch, good size. We're not really targeting them, but uh, we will definitely take them. We should get a white perch on the board because that's two points. We're not going to take first in that, but let's still take second. Yeah, we got to get one on the board. We might be able to jig them up while jigging for crappy. Yep. Yeah. That'd be almost more to take a second. So we're leading with a uh, 28 and a half inch pike. There's a second place pike, which is 21, maybe 20 and three quarters. Uh, there's a 17 and a half inch largemouth. There's a 13 and a half inch pickerel, 14 inch brown, 12 and a half inch brookie. Uh, there's a 16 and three quarter inch cusk. We have first place yellow, uh, which is 12 inches. There's a 10 and three quarters in second place. Uh, we have second place for crappy, which is 13, no, 12 and three quarters. And first place crappy is 13 and a half. Um, I think that is it. What was the brookie? Oh, no, there's a brookie was 12 and a half. Uh, there's a brown. Brown was 14. There's a white perch. All right, we just made the shift. We're heading to a new lake. Gonna go for some new species for us for today. Well, that was bad. We just tried two camp roads to get onto this lake, this pond, and everything is posted in private. And I could jump a lawn there and get on but that's not setting a good example for the boys and it's not something i would ever do so we're loaded back up and we think we found an access point up here All right, guys, we're just getting set up on this new lake. Nothing, boys, nothing. Any bait? Team Barrowville, 16 inch lake. Nice. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> 
He's got the armbar. I would tap for him. Don't hurt him. We need him for test fishing. Mm -hmm. Team Arrowville. Nice cusk. There's the code. Fifteen and a quarter, almost fifteen and a half inch pick roll. That's all Collins. Go for it. This this one's not moving. Yeah, this one's. Try it. Test it. Got him? Yep, got him. What is it? Pickerel. Let's go. Yeah. I got something playing with it. It's tiny. Is it? is it 16 inches? Back there. It's right here. Bring it over. You got something or what? Yeah. He's got one. It feels so. It's <laughs> pickerel. School of pickerel. Let's go. <laughs> Not. Got him. Yeah. Pickerel. It's not gonna help. I don't think it's bigger than Brandon's. Brandon's. Maybe. Not that much bigger. Same as yours. Maybe it is mine. Close your mouth. Yeah, it's probably mine. This one. This one might be. Oh. 15. He hits 15. Yep, 15. Brandon's look a little bigger. Oh, this one's Brandon's. This one's going to take three points. Yep, let's go. Oh, yeah, 16 and what? 16 and a half. All right, we got to get a picture of it. Yep. That's first? It's first. It's Jeez, that's points. tiny for a pickle. Yep, it is. But it's the biggest today. We'll take it. First place. Yeah. Mine or that yeah. one? Yours. Yep. Yeah. How big was it? 16 and a half. 15 and a quarter was the biggest. He's tiny. That's three points though. This place wasn't a total loss. That ain't gonna hold up, but we'll no. take it. Tomorrow we can get a big one. Yeah. That's we'll get your bigger one tomorrow. I'm gonna sell all mine for browns though. Because we already got the pickerel. Team Barrowville. Nice white oh. Nice white perch. Beautiful. <laughs> Beta! Jet skier, boys! <laughs> that was awesome. Alright, so let's get out of here while we still have a little gas. Supper. Yeah. We got a restroom here. Four How is it? Thirty-one inch half. Thirty-one and a half. And he got a sixteen-inch plate. Ten-inch white of salmon. If he gets a tow, we'll get a white fish. We might be in trouble. Thirteen and a 
Yeah, it's good pizza. It doesn't even have to be good, I bet. And it tastes good no matter what. Pepperoni. Are you liking it, Jack? Anymore or just 17? Just 17, but we only need to beat 16, 7, 5. Oh, yeah, keep 17. We're almost a half. 17 and a quarter. Really just <laughs> yep. Flag number two. Yeah, grab a piece of bait, guys. Oh, yeah. Got him? Yeah, he's, oh, he's in the rocks. Feels tiny. Real small. Oh, look how short he is. The thing's built like a tank. Get a Laker. What is it? I'm bigger than 17. Oh, yeah. 18. What? Nice, Jack. Oh boy, Jack, you're coming in. Language full of language. Don't break another Don't get either. that thing all slimed up in my heater, dude. That yeah. one's a decent size one. Yeah, that's... You can cook this guy up in the 19. heater. 19. Oh, yeah. Someone get the board. He's long. He's skinny. This is probably my PB cusk. Really? Hold him up. This is my third cusk ever. Oh, no kidding. Yeah, I caught one through the ice, one night fishing, and now this guy. It's pretty cool you're feeding him out. Eight, 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 eight. Come oh, on, baby. Oh, yeah. He's over 19. He's almost 19, 20. 19 and a half. Yep, 19 yeah. and a half. Good job, buddy. This is a big one. Well, I wish I could, but. It's a big one. I'll catch it. Don't mess it up. I haven't caught a fish on a trap today. It's a big one. Oh, no, I caught a pickerel. How big? It's 30. 30. Or we can come back in like 10 minutes. Yeah. Oh yeah. This is a toad. Lenny White? You got him? Yeah. It's a toad. Big toad. You can't tell the difference yet. It's a toad. That's a language. Oh yeah, it's big whatever it is. Yeah. It's a good one. Crappy, I think. Crappy. <laughs> or it's brown. Oh, whatever it is, we need it. Oh, yeah. Deva! Nice! Yeah. That's the one we needed. That might... Ooh, I don't know if that'll go 24. Yeah, he's going to be close to 24. Yeah. Where's the bump board? That, that's Dylan, good. bump board. We'll keep that. Yeah, yeah that's definitely... You want to keep that? Yeah. It's an eater. Cost nuggets, baby. We fried some up the other day. Best thing ever. Looking good. That might be second place, Jeff. We already have. They, they got freaking strong jaws, don't they? Yeah. <laughs> you got your finger in there? Yeah, I got two in there. No, I think that was a whole dead shiner. Uh, yeah, this one was. Come on, baby. Ah. Oh. 
It was a good upgrade though, 22, 22 and a quarter? Uh, just, just 22. 22? Yep. Got everything? Uh, I believe so. Okay. Okay guys, that's enough for tonight. We caught, geez, what we get? Three or four cusks? Four or five? Four cusks? Something like that. One, I got two, two, three, four. I think we got four. And we got one 22 and a quarter, and a quarter inch. That was our biggest. So that puts us up in the third for cusk as of right now. Gets us a point, right? Yeah. So that puts us back in the lead for the day. I can't see over there. For day one. We are in the leaderboard by one point, I believe. Two points. We took it. Took that. Oh, one, nice. That guy who's tied with us. All right. So it was 11-11. We took that cusp point, third place cusp to make it 12-10. I think there's another team with 10, a couple sevens, a five, I think, something like that. But I don't feel great about pretty much all of our species, so we got to pop a lot of species tomorrow. Yeah. Tomorrow we're starting out for browns and white perch. And then we're gonna make a move into largemouth bass, possibly crappy, possibly, possibly pickerel, rainbow, pickerel upgrade too. possibly pickerel upgrade. That'd be nice. A lot of possibles tomorrow. I don't want to spend any extra time on that because we Which have three be? points, but I don't think that'll hold. The only thing, honestly, I feel good about is that pike. Yeah. And so the perch is pretty good too. But. So rather than drive home an hour and a half the wrong direction and come back down here for a two hour drive tomorrow. We're gonna try, we're gonna drive about a half hour and get to the Hannaford Brothers parking lot and take a quick snooze. We got time for probably three hour, three and a half hour nap. Yeah. Hopefully we'll get a little sleep in there and meet the boys early in the morning. But, you know, it didn't feel like a great day of fishing to be honest with you. We didn't really smash them. We had opportunities for a lot more than what we did. I guess the rock bass is kind of a long shot. But yeah, yeah. And the crappy, we did what we expected. Did a little better than we expected there. Yeah, yellow, we probably could have hoped for a little bigger, but yeah. to walk out of hope, uh, that second pod with just the pickerel is a little disappointing. Yeah, that, that I wish but, we could have redone, but hey, that's fishing. That pod. You know can fish weird and it was definitely fishing weird. At least we walked out with three points. Yeah. I don't think he's that big. Get him. Yes, baby! Oh, I hate this guy. <laughs> 